Good evening everyone. Right now the search continues for the suspect in a deadly shooting who triggered an Amber Alert overnight. The baby at the center of that alert was found this morning and is safe. But her father, Akeem Daniels, is wanted tonight. He's believed to be traveling in a brown Honda Accord. According to Iberia Parish deputies, there was a custody dispute between Daniels and the mother of his child last night when her brother stepped in. Deputies say Daniels shot and killed that man, identified tonight as Cortland Hall. Abby Breidenbach joining us live in the newsroom with our top story. And Abby, you actually made contact with Akeem Daniels today. Jim, Daniels called his mother, Geraldine Jones, while I was interviewing her today. But when she handed me the phone, he hung up. Here's what he told her. Last night, he went to take his baby from her mother's house to his house. He says they started fighting instead, and she cursed at him. So he slapped her and took the baby anyway. That's when he says others started shooting at him and began chasing him. Akeem Daniels family claims he was unarmed. Well, Akeem told me he didn't have no gun. He said one of the day bullets must have hit him. That's what he told me. Okay. His, his, Akeem car all shot up. He was about to go to the, he was going to go to the fill station last night, but after he heard that the boy died, he panicked. Later, I spoke with the sheriff's office, who now has custody of Daniel's car. Though his mother claims there are bullet holes, the sheriff's office said they have no knowledge of that. They also say they do believe Daniels is the one who fatally shot Hall. In the studio, Abby Breidenbach, KATC TV3. Our investigative team is taking a look at Daniels' background. He was arrested in 2013 in connection with the shooting of his 8-year-old brother. At the time, deputies said a witness told them the shooting was an accident, but Daniels had already left the scene. He pleaded guilty to illegal use of a weapon in that case. In 2015, he pleaded guilty to illegal possession of a stolen firearm. He's still serving probation in that case. And last month, he pleaded not guilty to misdemeanor domestic abuse battery. That case involved the same woman involved in last night's shooting. Meanwhile, police are looking for two other men believed to be with Daniels tonight. Isaiah Johnson and Avon Francisco are wanted for questioning. If you know where they are, call the Iberia Parish Sheriff's Office. And here's one more look at Akeem Daniels tonight. Deputies say he should be considered armed and dangerous. If you see him, call 911. Taking a look at headlines.